Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm super excited because we have this Paradox Rift booster box. This is actually my first booster box that I'm opening for Pokemon cards. So I'm super excited to get into this set. I've watched a couple of videos of people opening this. I don't know all the cards in here, but I know that there's some cool special illustration rares that I want to get. Um, I think specifically I want the Roaring Moon and the Iron Valiant. I'm also interested in the Steelix and the Porygon Z. I really like the art on that. So let's get into this box. Nice display. Cool, it looks like it has four different artworks on the packs. I don't know the names of all these Pokemons. I, I know a lot. I played all the games, but I mean, I don't I don't know all the names. Armorage, Roaring Moon, Iron Valiant, Garchomp. Maybe I do know all of them. <laughs> uh, let's get into it. And I'm gonna go a little bit faster than normal because we just have a lot of packs to open. Age Slash, Surskit, whoa! Our very first pack, we get a mouse hold. This is actually one I want to open for my girlfriend. She's gonna love this one. Cool, all right. Mouse hold EX. I also started playing the game today. I downloaded a uh, Pokemon Live on my computer. It's pretty fun. I, I think the last time I played was uh, the Game Boy Color game on, uh, I don't know what year that came out, but it was, uh, it was a Game Boy game. Super pixelated, but they had the whole card game in there. So it was fun. I remember playing that a long time. Oh my, I, I like to see these like uh, old school Pokemon remixed. Wug Trio, That's cool. Dweeble, Gimme Cool, and Deoxys. Nice. So playing the playing the game on the on the computer, I realized how important trainers are for deck building and playing the game. I usually just like disregard the trainers since I never played the game, but they're pretty important. So I will definitely be keeping those trainers to make uh, some decks. Got Flamigo, Miltank, and a Veltal. Nice. Oh, look at this one. It's going into a girlfriend collection for sure. Mila, I heard that the alternate art of this is uh, the hit in this set. So we'll definitely be looking out for her. Mila, Crustle, and Iron Moth. Oh, look at this. Looks like the feature cards have a different uh, background. Pretty interested in how that works gameplay wise. Now that I start playing the game. Ooh, plus a tandem mouse. Let's go into the girlfriend collection. Toad's cool, another remixed Pokemon. This is supposed to be a tentacle. Tentacle? That's cool. Plusle, Blitzel, and Wochien. Wochien. Nice. Oh, 
Well, I think we have a hit in this one. I hope. Trubbish, Dual Blade, and Toxtricity wow. EX. Nice. Easy X Pokemon in the game I was playing today. Man, they destroy me. They're so strong, and like if you don't take care of them early, they just like take over the game, and I lost a lot. I don't know, I just started playing the game, so I'm, I'm learning, but man, the EX Pokemon are pretty important. Bunsweet, Flakoko, and Feeble. Cool. No illustration rares though. Oh, the other illustration rare I really want to see is the Porygon Z. I don't know if I mentioned that in the beginning, but the Porygon Z, man, I love that art. The, the Pokemon is in like a, a gaming room setup and he has like a gaming chair and Oh cool, look at that. Yeah, I, I love that art. I really hope to, to pull that one today. We got an Earthen Vessel, Porygon 2, and a Colossopod EX. Nice. Aqua Blade, Swing and Skedaddle. Discard an energy from this Pokemon. If you do, switch it with one of your benched Pokemon. Cool, so you can just get a hit in and switch it out. Nice. Yeah, so I've been playing the game, but I've been playing with whatever deck that you start with. So I'm sure it's like the basic, basic starter decks, but I was playing a, um, I don't remember what it's called, Lost Zone, I think. You start, you put your, your uh, cards in the Lost Zone and then you can use them as resources for other abilities and moves. Pretty fun, pretty cool. Look at that. Evil, Steelix, and Chi Yu. I really want to see the illustration of this card, but I like this as a Pokemon in, in general. Nice. Dual Blade, I used to have this in my party. I forgot what generation, but I remember using Dual Blade a lot. Rika, we got a Rork, Exploud, and a Chien Pao. Still looking for our first illustration rare. So like I said, it's my first booster box. I don't know like how they're seated or if they're seated at all, but I'm hoping they have at least a uh, uh, special illustration rare in each one. Another remix Pokemon, Wiglet. <laughs> Such a weird Pokemon. Okay, Golbat. Oh! Iron Moth and a Low, low Kicks? Law Kicks? Okay. Wow. That is nice. I forgot the name of the Pokemon this is supposed to be a feature Pokemon of, but... Wow, that's beautiful. Let's leave it up. I really like when they do this, like take original Pokemon and create alternate uh, versions of them. Like regional or even like uh, the mega Pokemon that they were doing for one of the generations where they change into a different form. I thought that was really cool. Toad cool. Got Joltik, Flittle, and a Kingdra. Kingdra. Nice. 
I was looking for the Cedra Reverse Hollow for a long time to finish my uh, 151 Master Set. That was one of the uh, Reverse Hollows that I could, could not find. I opened up so many packs, I could not find that one card. Parasol Ladies, another one I purchased. Uh, special Illustration Rare is uh, pretty expensive. Would not mind opening her either. Tinkatuff, Tandem Mouse, and a Steelix. Oh, look at that art. That's awesome. Another Tandem Mouse, Galvantula, and a Ting Lu. So I did play Scarlet. Um, I finished it, but I didn't get them. I didn't go for all the, the legendary Pokemon that you get at the end, like the Ting Lu and Chin Pao. So those are still pretty foreign to me. Like if somebody said that name, I would not be able to recognize the Pokemon. Wiglet and a Volcanion. First time seeing this card. It's pretty cool. Reminds me of like a Mega Man boss. Blue, Nicket, and a Larry Fuller. Nice. Like the typical salary man depiction in Pokemon. I can relate. Just grinding the nine to five. This card has like a like a nail. Somebody it looks like somebody indented it with a nail or something. Scream Tail. This is supposed to be a Jigglypuff remix. Cool. Deli Bird. Nice. Veltal, Magby, and a Zatu. This is the last pack of the left side. Gimme cool. And a Bombardier wow. EX. Nice. Every time I see this in the game, it reminds me of Zelda for some reason. I don't know why. Like opening up a chest, I play that 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 sound that sound clip in my head every time I see it. Oh wait, I forgot to sleep the bombardier. Overshadowed by the gimme ghoul. Oh yeah, the gimme ghoul evolution is also a, a special illustration rare in this set. The the string cheese guy, as everybody calls it. Hmm. Got a Purloin, a Nimble, and an Aegislash. Oh, the illustration rare, the Aegislash. That would be a good one to hit, too. The artist who did that also did a lot of uh, Legend of Zelda artwork, which I'm a huge fan of as well. Bothra and Groudon. Oh, the Groudon. The, sp the illustration rare of the Groudon is so cool too. And this Pokemon's name reminds me of a, a Bleach villain. <laughs> it's Bothra. Okay, 
cable. Got a Porygon, Blip Bug, and a Iron Jugulus, I think it's pronounced. It's a cool looking card. All right, still haven't hit a special illustration rare. Still, still searching. People seem split on this set. Uh, there's a lot of people that like it, but I've also heard a lot of people that are going to skip this set. But uh, I, I like. It. Oh, wow. we were just talking about this card, the Age of Slash illustration rare. Man, that is beautiful. It looks like it could be in Legend of Zelda, like the setting. Man, if I saw this in the game, that would be pretty cool. Maybe they should do a collaboration. Add this as a weapon that you can get in Zelda. Let's put it next to the other illustration where we got. Bam. Nice. All right, we're rolling. Got a snow run, a semi sage, and a a spathra again. Professor Satis Vitality, a Vanillux, and a Glossopod. That's pretty cool art. Oh, I see. Some borders. I think there's gonna be something big in here. We got a vanillish, a luxurious cape, and a Mewtwo EX. So weird seeing Mewtwo in electric form. But I like it, it's different. I kind of want to try playing him. We're running out of space, we got a lot of hits. Ooh, Jirachi. Oh my goodness. We hit a Gold Dango Special Illustration Rare. Wow, that is nice. Wow. Almost doesn't look like a Pokemon card, huh? This is just like a weird looking Pokemon, but it's a Pokemon. <laughs> very, very nice. Awesome. Gold Dango EX. Sweet. Okay, let's add this to the collection. Oh, 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 there we go. Nice hit. All right. I think that's a, one of the higher value the cards in this set. Whoa, cool. Snorlax doll, nice. Zekrom, an Apom, and a Porygon Z. Alright, looks like we got about eight packs left. Let's see if we can get a couple more hits here. But I am pretty satisfied with this box opening. I feel like I got a lot of good hits so far already. Mackley, Horsey, oh, wow. and a Sandy Shock CX. Wow. This is the uh, Magne Magneton variant. 
as a ground type. That's pretty cool. Seizure reverse again, Nackley, and then Melodic. Pants here, Octillery, and Clay Art, that's really cool. And a this guy. <laughs> I'm not gonna try to pronounce his name. Some salt Pokemon. Oh, Onyx Reverse. Char Char Cadet. And a more Peko. Got a Spinda, Absol, and a Palkia. Nice. I just opened up a, uh, uh, a Korean set and I opened up the origin form of Palkia. But I think I like the original version of Palkia better. The other one looks like you know, a little weird, deformed, like a space horsey. A Remoraid, Wimpod, and an Iron Moth. to go. Got a light card. Whoa, I forgot this card. Vanillish and a Wochian. Man, this is such a such a cool card. I love seeing these cards where the Pokemon are in like our world. So this one, Vanillish is in the ice cream shop. Man, this is such a cool card. I like this set. I, I don't know, I don't understand the haters for this set. There's some cool arts to be pulled in this set. Uh, I'll just put them here for now. Vanillish. Toad's Pool and a Brute Vana. I think this is the first time seeing this guy. I forgot what the original Pokemon of this guy is based off of, but I hate seeing him in the game. It's really annoying. <laughs> All right, guys, last pack. Even if there's no hit in this, I am very satisfied with our box opening today. We got some cards that we wanted. We got some new cards, some cool artworks. Rachi, Nackley, Parasol Lady, Screamtail, Technical Machine, Explode, a Colossiopod, Colosso, Colossopod, a Mantike, and a Chiyu. All right. Let's go over all of our hits. I guess we'll start with the EXs and then go with the illustration rares or the full arts and then the illustrations. 
in the special. So we got Sandy Shock EX, Mew TV X, Polisopod EX, Toxtricity EX, Bombardier EX, and then we got a Full Art Mousehold EX, a Full Art Larry, and then for our illustration wares, we got Aegislash, Vanillish, and Iron Moth. And finally, our special illustration wear, the Gold Dango. So all in all, oh man, I'm really happy with this box. I was definitely looking for these two. This is a really cool art too. They're all cool. I don't know. I have nothing bad to say. This was fun. I have, we have a lot of uh, other packs or other products that we are planning on opening, so stay tuned. We will see you next time. Thanks for watching.